What's up YouTube, Pete here from The Sunday Drive, and today we're going to show you how to remove the rear seat from your first gen Silverado. Now the only tools you'll need for this are an 18 millimeter socket and a trim removal tool. Other than that, it's a very straightforward process. Now today we're working with my 2004 extended cab LS Silverado 1500, but it should be the same for the crew cab. So step one is fold your seat up. All right, now we're gonna go to the other side and remove a trim piece. On the driver's side, before you can get to the nuts, you need to remove this trim piece. There are three pins holding it in on the front and left and right side. With that trim piece removed, there are a total of five 18 millimeter nuts that need to be removed. The passenger side does not have a trim piece covering the nuts. The fifth nut is in the center of the seat on the bottom and it holds these two cables down. Go ahead and lift this. Now the back of the seat is actually held to the truck via these hooks. So we need to lift the whole seat assembly up before we can pull it out. So if you come around the back, you can see the hook assembly I'm talking about. Right here. And that hooks onto these bars on the back of the truck. That's how you remove the rear seat from your first gen Silverado. If you have any other questions about your first gen Silverado, feel free to ask us and we'll try to make a video helping you if we don't already have one on our channel. We also have a third gen Silverado, so be sure to check that out if you have any questions regarding that truck. If you found this video to be helpful, please give us a big thumbs up and subscribe. 